So what we're looking at here, this is the subgrade, the uh, ground below the road of 4th Avenue South. And if you look that way, that's towards the high school. And our goal is to get this part of the paving done yet this year. It'll happen fairly late in the fall, but we'd like to get it paved to 21st and then back north up by Casey's. So that'll provide a little better uh, traffic flow for the high school. So and here we are as we're again, we're on 21st Street. So right now looking north towards Casey's. And then if you follow it going south, this is pretty close to what the grade of the road will be. And where the cranes are, that's where the railroad bridges will be, so that's the low point of our underpass. Uh, so we're, we're looking here, this is the shoe fly for the Otter Tail Valley track after it's already joined in with the BNSF track. So they're together for this piece. And that is some sheet piling you can see around part of the excavation that they needed to do to build some of the walls. And that is uh, where we had the slope failure back in early August. And as a result of that, they're still doing some evaluation and determining what they need to do to proceed on the work that is close to the shoe fly. So that's that set our schedule back a fair amount on the project. We, we do still hope to recover and still hit our completion date uh, of the middle of next summer to get the project completely done. Out the lowest point of the underpass where we'd be going underneath the bridges. And you can see they're, they're still, they've got the retaining wall they're working on, or the, the bridge pier. And the, the pump station is in the distance there. You can see and they've got some wood uh, railing built around it. So right now we're standing at the area of Main Avenue that used to intersect with 19th Street. And so we reconstructed the roadway coming down into the underpass. The old 19th Street, which is by the Tasty Freeze, it was too steep of a drop to tie in, so they have a new connection that's a little bit west of where it used to be, and hopefully that will be back and open to traffic soon, which will help this area uh, for traffic flow. 